Hello everyone, Chief Meteorologist Brian Hale. Now tropical storm bill forecast to continue moving and make landfall across the Texas coast near Port Lavaca. A fairly impressive storm on satellite. It will, as I said, continue to move on across the coast around 7 to 9 a.m. and then push up into the state east of Austin and then to the north. Expected to dump a lot of rain in an area that does not want to see any more rain. Flooding is going to be a big part of the risk involved with that storm. Our biggest risk is going to continue to be the rip current along our shore. High to dangerous risk on through Tuesday. Futurecast takes uh, Bill, puts it on up into southeast Texas, at least the heavy rains on the northeast side, and marches it right north as an area of low pressure. But again, the amount of rain generated by this storm uh, injected into Texas is going to be a big problem for flooding potential in an area that has already seen uh, dangerous and deadly floods. Futurecast runs through the Rio Grande Valley with an opportunity for showers and thunder showers. And where some of the uh, showers and thunder showers slow down a bit, we could see up to one to two inches of rainfall. Otherwise, a spread of anywhere from a few tenths to an inch expected across the valley throughout the day in through the day Tuesday. Extended forecast continues the chance for showers and thunder showers through Thursday. Basically, we have enough moisture in our atmosphere uh, to provide that opportunity. And then on to the end of the week, we go back to just the odd afternoon shower. That's a look at your storm tracker forecast.